Hi, I'm Jen Zielinski, downtown Kelowna at the busk stop by the sales. This will be the first stop at Festival's Kelowna second annual Buskers on Bernard event, which happens Thursday at 7 p.m. and will continue until the buskers can't busk anymore. This year we're going to have probably two to three per block, both sides of Bernard Avenue. So if you come to the entrance to City Park at what we call busk stop number one, and then if you keep going east past the sales, there's going to be performances in Cary Park, all the way to Pendozi on both sides of the street. Buskers on Bernard is a mini version of a Buskers Festival. In BC, one of the most popular Buskers Festivals is that which takes place in Victoria. We had done some initial research and we weren't sure we were quite ready yet to pull off a full Buskers Festival, but this was a great way to test the waters. Uh, the other thing is we've seen some amazing artists come through our office over the years as Buskers, and this was a really neat way to draw attention to them kind of in a condensed manner. There will be 15 Buskers performing a wide variety of talent that will be fun for kids of all ages. So we have some really neat performers lined up. Uh, one of the ones we had last year, which is really cool, was uh, Jonathan Heaven, and he's got, I believe it's called a hang bowl. Um, we have some dancers. We've got a belly dancer lined up. We're just working on getting some hip hop dancers. We've got Zach Gauthier, who you might have seen around the downtown, who plays on anything that sits still long enough. We have vocalists as well. Uh, we've got a couple clowns. We've got a balloon artist. So quite a range of different kinds of artists that we've already got in our program. Well, there are no plans in the works as of yet for an entire Buskers Festival, Buskers on Bernard is sure to be back next year. For Castanet News, I'm Jen Zielinski.